On September 7th, Harlem Women International invited the First Lady of the Federal Republic of Nigeria to the State Office Building during her stay in New York for the United Nations General Assembly. Uh, but on behalf of Congressman Rangel, uh, we welcome the First Lady of Nigeria to our country. Also, the Congressman brings his greetings to uh, the Queen Mother, Harlem. Thank you. And uh, really, it's no presentation, but we just want to present uh, the First Lady with a special recognition from the United States Congress. We want to know that these are community workers, that we must uh, let them know that they're here today to honor her. On March 8th at the UN, we're going to be celebrating all mothers of strength and courage around the world. Thank you very much. And we have uh, Will Thompson. Will Thompson. Thompson's office. I divinely and respect all of you. Um, on behalf of William C. Thompson, Jr., first African-American controller, I greet you on his behalf, and um, he wishes he could be here and couldn't be here. At one time, I thought I was in Nigeria. And then I, when I look around, I say, oh, no, I'm sitting in New York. Thank you very much for the love, for the care, and the kindness. And I promise you that I will come back, and I will not, because even when I lived, I will take some of your numbers so that we can continue communicating. As she said, you don't value a mother until she is not among us. You know, motherly love is something divine. Thank you very much, mother. I lost my mother about four years back. That is why I know how valuable a mother is. Because when she is alive, I just take her as for granted she's there. But after I lose her, I know how valuable a mother is. And each house needs a mother, because the mother is the past teacher in each house. And she is the mother, the teacher of each one of us. No matter who you are, the mother is, the past, is your past teacher. We need peace, as they say. Peace is the key, word, key way to the progress. When we are fighting, when we are killing each other, there will be no progress. And the two religions, either Christianity or, is, or Islam, none of the religions say that shall kill. Hmm. None. Hmm. So as, and if God wants us to be one, if God wants us all to be Christian, we will have been all Christian. But if God wants us to be all Muslim, we will have been all Muslims. But this is God wish, that is what God wants. So we shall. Who are we to ask God? And who are we to say that mm, we are fighting each other because of the religion? We have to live together. We have to be sisters and brothers if we have to have peace. And we need that peace. Thank you very much. I, I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you.